Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I have returned from TwitchCon Vegas and we have been blessed with a new Apex Legends gameplay trailer for season 19 coming up. Now, I have been away from Apex for a bit and I have no knowledge at all about this new season and going into it. So let's take a look at the trailer. We'll give our reaction, break it down. Let's go. Every storm eventually breaks. Light always pierces through. I believe this is the you new legend speaking. Not to break first. In my family, we call that strength Pagasa. Hope. Hope. Okay. We got another trailer with some fire music, same with the last. Conduit. Sav Savior Speed. Radiant Transfer. Stick it, stick it, stick it, stick it. That's her ultimate energy barricade. For the viewers at home, it feels as cool as it looks. Okay. Storm point energized. So we're getting some updates to Storm Point. It looks good. I really do like the music though. There goes my girl Vantage. Cross prog cross progression arrives. Yeah! Yes! Finally! Finally! With at the start of the season, I hope so. Light always pierces through. Oh, that's pretty cool. Didn't your tell you not to Uh selfie finisher, I love it. Apex Legends Ignite. October 31st. Halloween. We're getting the uh we're getting the new season on Halloween. How does how does that work? It's great. Um, wow. <laughs> I, I think it's pretty clear what I got hyped about most in that trailer, but it was pretty cool. I love the music. The the last the last reaction I did had um I think it was the, the one of the Revenant trailers had really good music. This one also really good music. They've really been up in their music game over at Apex, but let's take a look at this and break it down real quick. So the trailer starts off giving us a couple of uh panoramic shots of our new storm point which have which has been busted up a little bit and there's gonna be some changes to it hopefully there's gonna be some better map flow we do have our new legend here which is conduit and i believe she's like an energy based weapon i think she's able to like heal your teammates shields which would be interesting she'll be like a good like utility legend going into the game love it there's conduit now i want to take at her take a look at her first um ability here her passive actually so save your speed gain a burst of speed when running towards a teammate out of tactical range interesting so if you're lagging behind on your team or even if you're you know if you're the running gun type that goes ahead of your team you're gonna get a speed boost i'm wondering how much of a boost that is like is it like a bangalore double time type of speed boost because like this will technically make her like kind of like as a solo playstyle legend pretty powerful in regards to movement with the fact that you have extra speed when your teammates are not around so for those of you that like to lone wolf you're probably going to really enjoy this and uh, we have our tactical here. So Radiant Transfer, send a surge of energy to a teammate, generating temporary shields for them and conduit when in danger. Interesting. So you can generate temporary shields. Huh. Could make for a really good aggro push, giving your teammates shields, giving yourself shields, pushing upon those extra shields or bunkering down, staying alive, survival. Should be interesting. I'm really liking the the PK gameplay in this. 
Okay, so now we're gonna get a look at her ultimate. Here we go. So, energy barricade. This is her ultimate. Deploy an array of shield jamming devices which damage and slow enemies. Damage and slow enemies. Okay. Hmm, I wonder what the radius is on this thing. Because if it's a, like a, I don't know, like a, a seer alt type of like radius, it could be like really good. Especially with the slow end. Like you're gonna slow the guy and then pop them in, you know, the butt with some bullets. Yeah, I think it's I think it's gonna be a pretty good ultimate. So f some people are speculating that she's gonna be kind of overpowered to start. It's uh left to be seen. And then we have Stormpoint Energy, so we got some new POI changes. Um I'm looking forward to seeing what Stormpoint is gonna play like moving forward. A lot of people Stormpoint is not their favorite map just because of like flow but this right here cross progression arrives now i've been playing apex since literally season zero day one they released a launch trailer i downloaded the game i've been playing it on xbox since day one so i have a lot of like old stuff in my xbox account i'm interested to see how they're going to implement this is it going to be a account murder situation or are you going to have to leave an account behind because i do have quite a bit of progress on my pc account some skins and such it'll be very heart reckoning to let some of that stuff go but if i had to choose i would probably want my xbox stuff back to play with on pc um let me know in the comments below what you guys are going to choose if you had to you know we're we're, in, we're going into season 19 what what stuff are you going to save your console or your uh your pc so i hope hopefully i uh, hopefully they do it pretty well but i'm excited to see what cross progression would look like and i'm excited to see what the season is going to look like it looks like it's going to be really cool there's a lot of um a lot of changes coming to the season and there may even be some hidden changes too that we don't know about so you know more to look forward to selfie with the finisher that's conduit that's season 19 apex legends ignite looking forward to seeing where this season takes us hope you guys are excited i'm definitely excited let me know in the comments below what you are most looking forward to for apex legends ignite and uh, i'll see you guys on the next one later